He's following me. This is crazy. This is crazy. Legit, so many cops right there. Hey, officer, I actually need your help right now. What seems to be the problem? Someone's been following me. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I don't have my camera. I didn't bring my camera today. You guys are probably wondering what's on my eye. We were actually just filming at the TMR house. I was going home and I thought something was weird because this car has literally been following me. I don't know who it is. Anywhere I go, any turn I take, even trying to throw them off and they're following me nonstop right now. And so I'm getting kind of sketched out. I had to grab my phone and just start filming just because I don't know where it's going to go. And I'm not going to go back to my house right now just because they're still following me. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna maybe stop by Target and try to throw them off. I don't know what's going on, guys. It might be that stalker dude, it might be some someone else, or it might just be no one, I might just be overthinking it, but I've been seeing a lot of comments about, you know, what happened to stalker, what happened to the guy in an attic, and I was like, I mean, it's gone. The guy's gone, we don't need to worry about that, but honestly, I don't know what's going on. This dude has been following me. If it's a dude or a woman, the windows are untinted, but I am going to go to Target and then see if I can throw them off right now if not then i am uh i don't know what i'm gonna do if i can i'm just go straight home after this because you guys know I'm, I'm starting to stream a lot more go follow me on twitch.tv slash stoves underscore kitchen because i'm supposed to be streaming tonight but i don't think i'm going to be able to stream anytime soon just because i need to throw this guy off so i'm going to turn off the camera right now just because i don't want to be filming and driving i'll see you guys at target and see if this dude is still on my tail all right guys i'm here at target right now i'm about to turn in but this dude is still literally on me i mean there's a lot of cars right now he hasn't let loose he hasn't let up and i've been just overthinking it just because i've been you know reading these comments about the stalker and stuff and that's in my head and i'm like okay maybe this oh bro they're turning in actually too either he's going to target he went to the you know target that's very far away i mean i'm coming here because it is a public space and hold on a second let me get a ticket ow he's literally still behind me okay um bro his windows are so tinted i can't tell who it is okay let me park and then uh Try to sneak in. Let him notice me. All right. I'm parked up. I'm gonna go inside. Pretty sure if you guys got a glimpse of it, I'm pretty sure it was a Range Rover, a white Range Rover, and it's right over there. This turned off the car. It was right there. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna go inside. Put my mask on. Try to throw this guy off. I'm, I'm, what I'm gonna do is literally just try to run around and see if I can just catch him off guard. And I'm literally gonna try to run out of Target and leave. So. Okay, I'm gonna first like go to the closed section and then like sneak around there and then see what happens. Hold on. Second floor, going down. Guys, comment down below if you guys have any clues, any idea who you think this might be. I texted everyone on the okay. team. Hopefully they respond quickly. Oh, got some Pokemon stuff. <laughs> Yo, I'm like looking all around. I'm like sketched out. There is security here, so if anything happens, I'm literally going to yell. <laughs> okay, there's no one in these aisles. I'm walking around and making no sense where I'm walking to. So people who are watching on the, on the cameras and Target probably like, what's going on? Okay, guys, you see that guy in the hood? He was literally walking like the same direction and he looked in my direction as I was looking down the aisles. I don't know if you guys could tell, but now he's walking back. <sighs> I'm going to walk. I'm going to walk over here. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna act like I'm, oh, look at these bottles. Oh, cool. Guys, comment down below what I should do. Um, I'm gonna maybe, I might just purchase something actually. This is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy. What's going on? Okay, I'm in the doggy section. Maybe I'll pick up some treats. I know my dog likes these. I'll get some of these. Green bones. I'm just gonna slowly start heading back. I don't know where this dude is. Uh, I'm going to the home section. I'm just gonna chill there for a bit. Guys, I didn't come to Target just to buy dog treats. I'm just doing this just so, you know, the Target people don't think I'm like super suspicious. I said don't be suspicious, but I'm up here. I don't, I don't see him. I guess that's what, you know, People who follow you do, they're good at hiding. I don't 
don't know. I don't see him. So I'm actually gonna check out and try to leave real quick. Hold on a second. Now I'm literally rushing. The car is still there though. That means that they're still here. They're probably still trying to look for me to be honest. So I'm gonna rush out real quick. I don't know what's going on. I made eye contact with this guy. So I'm gonna rush home and see if I can lose this guy real quick. I'll update you guys if anything else happens. But for now, I think I'm in the clear. I think I lost him. I, I was literally walking around, even off camera. I was walking around like crazy. I was in like the baby section. I was in the clothes section. I was in the travel section. I was in all the sections like randomly, but I had to buy something because on Target, it probably looks super sketchy that I'm literally just walking around and looking around uh, for someone watching me. So probably, you know, not a good look. The SUV is still there on the right. Right there. That's the, literally the same car that followed me all the way here. And I can't get out right now, bro. They gotta... Okay. This person's going up first. Hurry up, hurry up. Oh, dude, I think he's in there. There's no way that dude is just waiting in his car for me to leave. Dude, I'm like only like 30 miles per hour in the parking garage. I'm trying to get out. Good, all right, we're free. Dude, he's following me. Hold on a second, there's people in front of me. Um, I'm gonna have to turn this off real quick. Hey guys, quick update. It's dark out right now and the lights are shining directly at the side view mirror. He literally was close and then all of a sudden he backed up, made so much like distance between us. Come on. Bro, he actually went. Okay, I'm not going home right now because this dude is literally still behind me. Dude, what is going on right now? Okay, he might actually pull up right next to me. Dude, this is sketch. This is super sketch right now. It's a white Range Rover right, literally right next to me. I wanna try to let them go ahead of me, but literally, it's the same one. It's literally the same one. Okay, he actually turned right here. This dude slowed down like crazy. I don't know, hopefully you guys could see what was through his windows. It looked tinted enough where I couldn't make out who it is but they slow down like crazy and they turn right with me yeah i'm gonna set this down right here because i don't want to be filming like holding the camera i think i actually might have lost him sorry guys this video is probably super dark oh geez there's like a whole bunch of cops what is going on legit so many cops right there all right guys i'm gonna get out of the car right now because the cops are here and i mean i think there's something else going on but there's some cops down the street that literally had this whole block like blocked off and i couldn't even tell they're cops because some of the cops cars don't have their lights on so let me actually all right guys i'm gonna walk up to the uh officers i want to keep it kind of low key so they don't see that i'm filming but let's see what happens hey officer i actually need your help right now what seems to be the problem? Someone's been following me. How long has this been going on for? They've literally been following me from where I work. I'm trying to get home. Every turn I do, they've been following me. Do you know where they are now? No, I don't know where they are now. You have to resolve this at the police station. Oh, I have to go down to the station? Yes, and file their report. Can't just like kind of stick around here for a little bit? No, you can't stay here. This is a crime scene. It's a crime scene right now? Okay. Um. Did you catch their license plate number? I didn't catch their license plate. Oh, actually I have a video. Can I show you a little bit? If you have a friend, you can stay with them. That would probably be safest. Stay at a friend's house? Okay, maybe that's, that's not a bad idea. Thank you, officer. I'm gonna turn on the light right now. He said stay at a friend's house, which is not a bad bad idea. I can stay at Ryan's house, but I don't see this, I guess, white Range Rover that's been just following me around. They probably saw that I came to all the cops. I'll, I'll pass by the cops again to show you guys like I, there are actually legit cops. I guess there's something going on right now and I can't stay here for too much longer. I don't know, maybe I should go home. I'm gonna maybe do a block and if I don't see him, I might go home, but We'll see. All right, let's do this. Right here, guys, look at that. There's a whole bunch of cops right there. Bro, I don't even know where I'm at. I'm in some random spot right now. So far, I, I don't see that white SUV, that white Range Rover right now so far, which is a good sign. Honestly, they could pop out of nowhere. Yeah. Guys, I, I, we might have actually lost him. Or I might be just overthinking this whole thing and it could just be no one and they're just, they're trying to get home, you know? I mean, I'm just glad that I was able to talk to one of the officers. I mean, I could go down the station. I have video proof and stuff. I just can't go to the one where, where I called the cops and it said to never call them back. I just can't go to that station. I saw a white car SUV behind the car that's behind me or like a white top and 
I thought it was literally a range where I was gonna freak out right now. Okay, I've been driving around for like 30 minutes and I haven't seen any signs of the Range Rover or anyone else that's been following me. I might have been overthinking it. I'm heading home now. I'm gonna actually park probably like a little bit further down the street than I, where I normally park just to like see if anyone shows up or if anyone else parks like close by. Honestly, I feel like someone already knows where I live. Oh my gosh, one second. No way. Dude, they're slowing down. It's not it's not a Range Rover though. That car literally pulled to the side and it looked like it was about to go right behind me. I freaked out. I legit my heart dropped right now. I've been here for about you know five ten minutes now. No signs of any Range Rover, any white SUV, no other car that's like parking up next to me suspiciously. There's people just walking around. Good thing is by the time this video comes out, I'll already be in Florida, so that's gonna be a nice break for me from all this craziness. But legit, I don't know what's going on with this person. I could just be overthinking it though. I could just be overthinking it, and um, you know, this whole stalker, you know, dude in the attic, whatnot, is just getting to me, and I'm just like being paranoid. Um, it's better to be safe than sorry. I think I'm in the clear. I think I'm good to go home. It's been like almost two hours since um, I left the team raw house. But if anything else happens, I'll update you guys. Everything's on my phone right now. Legit. Just had to pick up like a phone and camera and just start filming because I don't know what was going to happen. I just needed to at least film it. It's not a laughing matter, uh, but I'm thankful that I think I'm good. So thank you guys for watching. I'm going to stream and I'll see you guys over there at twitch.tv slash stoves underscore kitchen. I know I sound like a, a broken record, but I'm trying to get onto the full streaming thing. So hopefully I see you guys over there and I'll also, I, I made a whole Discord thing. I know I'm plugging myself right now, but the more people in there, the better. If someone is actually like following me, it'd be live. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe, go follow me everywhere. Until next time, peace.